Hello everyone. Today I'm going to talk about patellar fracture imaging. Definition: patellar fracture plus minus extensor mechanism disruption. Extensor mechanism: quadricepsis of the line and patellar tendon also include Media and Latra retina to life, femoral ligament. Clinical presentation. More common signs and symptoms, pain, swelling, and increased extension stretch, like joint fusion or hematosis, inability to perform straight leg raise, point tenderness over patella, effect in smooth patella on a patient. Demography, age most common from 20 to 50 years, patella sleep erosion, more common for children, predominant male, More than female, two, two, one. Epidemiology, 1% one of all strata fiction. Majority are direct trauma. Six are more common than cortisol of the Latin structure. Also control fracture with the 5% of patella femoral dislocation. Pathology, direct blow to patella, indirect injury, tensile force generated by cortisol mechanism, secondly to grab harvest for anterior cruise ligament reconstruction. Top differential diagnosis. Malpati patellar, failure of fat suppression, those are the effect of patellar, control malaria patellar, signing large Sam Johansson syndrome. Less known is a clue. Loose, loose and fracture line plus minus fragment displacement on radiograph. Patella alpha are such for small inferior port evasion, patella baja, are such for small superior port evasion. According to location, transfer fracture around 80% in mid portion or lower one side. Longitudinal fracture, consistently lateral facet. Evasion fracture may occur at any patella border. Side, range from tiny evasion fragment to large displaced fragment. Again, to morphology, transfer around 52 to 60 percent. Stellate. Commuted fracture, 30 to 35 percent. Longitudinal, around 12 to 17 percent. Marginal evasion, what is the patella tendon, erythinaglone, insertion, also control injury, patella sleep injury. Inferior or superior for evasion attached to and ossified cartilage and articular surface component. More common patellar fractures less than 16 years old. Radiograph finding. Lateral radiograph. Transfer fracture line plus minus diastasia. Fracture displacement and commutation. Articular surface in 
concreity, small evasion fragment, polar superior or inferior, plus minus visible ossified evasion in sleep fracture. Patella alta, high patella, such as patella tendon rupture, assess for small inferior pole fracture, may occur with patella sleep fracture. Patella barger, low patella, such as quadricep tendon rupture, Assess for small superior pole fracture, soft tissue mass of retracted tender plus edema, joint infusion. AP and sunrise axial rotebra, fracture displacement and commutation. Longitudinal fracture line. Plus minor calcified or secondary fracture of major patellar facet or lateral femoral corneal after lateral dislocation. This lateral knee is resolved. A widely disruptive branch fracture of the mid portion of pad line, not the redundant quadrus of weisslick arrow indicated and patella by curve arrow indicated, tendon due to a loss of tension on the extension mechanism. Side fracture are usually due to tensile overload. So this knee radiograph, so the sharp inferior head, wide solid arrow indicating of the superior fracture fragment. The inferior fragment wide curve arrow is difficult to see. This radiograph of the knee in AP view, so a non displaced transfer fracture, widespread arrow indicated of the interior portion of patellar. Non displaced fracture are often easier to see in the AP projection than displaced fracture. Lateral knee radiograph. So the transfer non displaced fracture, wise slip arrow indicated in the inferior part line. Transfer fracture are open due to force extension. Again, a contracted portison. When it's placed smaller than three millimeters. They are often treated conservatively. AP radiograph of the knee, so long longitudinal fracture of the patella, device with arrow indicated, due to a direct flow injury, the sharp edge of the Fracture differentiate this from a knee party satellite. Again, AP radiograph of the knee. So a community patella fracture with fracture line, sign solid arrow, standing in multiple direction, there's limited displacement. This is the skyline or sunrise view of the knee radiograph. So, an angular impaction fracture 
science solid error indicate of the major facet of the pathologic with a displaced fragment cyan curve error. This pattern of fracture is specific for transient dislocation of the pathologic. A lateral knee radiograph, so also as fragment, cyan solid arrow indicated at the anterior distal pole of the pathologic. This may be secondary ossification center of pathologic refracture. Swollen inferiorly. Cyan curve arrow suggests the latter. CT finding similar to radiograph with better sensitive for small evasion fragment, better for direction of particular surface offset. Patella femoral alignment assessment, intra articular bone fragment, associated familiar tibia fracture. A coronal CT of the knee, so the fracture science solid arrow indicated in much better detail. So stellate fracture says this uh, due to direct trauma, trauma, they often demonstrate mild and mild is placed to be treated without surgery. The overlying extensor, appendibrosis, and adjacent retinacula keep the fragment in place. Okay. The porosity of the part of the knee so longitudinal fracture science or it in the patient with a total knee prothesis. The fracture involved two of the whole cyan curve arrow indicated housing the anterior page of the patella component. Very prosthetic patella fracture usually involve this hole. Reserve the stress riser. Axial CT of the knee. So the fracture, silent science solid arrow located with overlying soft swelling. Very prosthetic fracture about the knee are most common in the distal area, but also occur in the papua. Axial CT, so the unusual coronary oriented papua fracture, cyan solid arrow in the as a result of a direct blow injury, not the offset of the Articular surface cyan code arrow indicated, which is relatively mild. Am I finding fracture line? You saw a low signal on T1 and T2. Surrounding narrow edema, articular cutlet disruption, shiny shoes on plus minus here or mega or lacca retina coulomb. Major part below camera alignment. Plus minus increase T2 signal. Laxity, laxity discontinuity of patella tendon and cortisol. Also, control fracture, evident of tension, lots of patella dislocation. Low signal pregnant in joint space or adjacent to. Patla on all second can care the quality of inferior major patla specific or transient dislocation. Sleep fraction separate two ossifying patlic joining 
Atlan and Tandem was a particular cartridge sleeve of Patla hollow polar pigment and separate from Patla low signal cartilage plus minus bone pigment in joint space of adjacent to Patla or, or sequence. Like cartilage pigment, less than DGS may require surgery. So this is a MRI of the knee, so longitudinal fracture through the patella, the edge of the fracture pigment are sharp and not sclerotic. This is extensive narrow edema, an eruption of the antiglot cartilage, silent open arrow in it, including the three party patella. Ultra sonographic finding used to assess progress in the picture. As a sign of associated cartilage fragment, not visible on the paper. Bone scan. Bone scan of my may be useful for stress fracture or be but the cutlass single androsis fracture. Should the shoes in this particular things, my body will. Take one message. AP radiograph can be poorly negative. Tiny evasion pigment may be potent major soft tissue injury, persistent pain and arthritis happen in 15%, 50%. Good excellent surgical results recorded in 80 to 80%. Patlectomy, in case of new instability and degrees extension strength. Thank you.